Welcome back to the Big Ranch Show. Thank you for joining me. I have some breaking news from the Alec Baldwin uh, involuntary manslaughter trial. The case was dismissed with prejudice this afternoon by the judge after his attorney had filed a motion to dismiss based on prosecutorial uh, misconduct during the discovery phase and not properly um, presenting evidence. Uh, let me give you a little, a few things here from CNN who's been reporting this. It says, in a stunning move Friday, Judge Mary uh, Marlowe Summer dismissed the involuntary manslaughter charge against the actor Alex, Alec Baldwin in the 2021 death of cinematographer Helena Hutchison on the set of the Western film Rust. It goes on to say, Baldwin's attorney had filed a motion to dismiss the case, arguing the mis arguing the misconduct by the state investigators in not properly disclosing evidence. The case was dismissed with prejudice, meaning the prosecutors cannot bring it back. Um, so that is some um, like big breaking news right now. Um, nobody was expecting this, I don't think, uh, especially right now. Uh, I think a lot of people thought it was at least get to the end of it, and then maybe he would be found not guilty or something, but no. Um, it says here, Baldwin pled not guilty and has maintained he did not pull the trigger after the prop, the discharge of a prop gun. If convicted, he would have faced up to 18 months in prison and a $5,000 fine. Um, as fa fallout will continue from this for sure, um, but the attorney for Han Hannah Gut Gutierrez Reed, um, the armorer, the one that was supposed to be taking care of the guns, who was um, found guilty and put in jail, um, has said that they will seek to have her conviction thrown out as well um, on the same grounds. Uh, apparently, it has to do with um, weapon or rounds that were taken from the set, apparently, that were given to police and to the, or to the prosecution to be tested. Um, and apparently, when they were supposed to be giving all the evidence or showing all the evidence and just during discovery to give, I guess, the, the defense attorneys, I'm not big on, very knowledgeable on legal stuff um, like that, but um, apparently they were supposed to give all the information over. And apparently there was a, when they were giving these, this new information, this, these new um, bullets that were supposed to be tested, they put them in a different case file entirely. So when the case came before the court and during discovery, um, the defense was never given this information. So the case is dismissed with prejudice, cannot be brought back against Alec, ba Alec Baldwin. So Alec Baldwin is free and does not is will not face any more charges, at least not manslaughter charges, in this case involving Rust. Um, I'm sure he hopes this is the you know putting going to put it behind him and be done with it. Um, but we will see what happens down the road, especially with um, the armor who was first convicted earlier this year. Um, in this particular incident. It was a terrible incident back on the rust set. Um, something happened with the gun. Uh, Baldwin still to this day says he never touched the trigger and that it went off. It was, well, I guess we'll see what happened, you know, what happens down the road. But right now he is free and clear and it does not appear this case can be brought back against him. Anyway, anyways, that's the Big Ranch Show. Thank you for um, joining us for this breaking news and have a great day. See you down the road.